Elite Wrestling is leading a renaissance in professional wrestling. It's the year 2024, and over the last few years, All Elite Wrestling has fully established itself as the premier wrestling promotion in the world. Under the leadership of Tony Khan, All Elite Wrestling has captured the imagination of wrestling fans with its emphasis on athleticism, compelling stories, and larger-than-life characters. Many point to the 2022 episode of All Elite Wrestling Dynamite on February 23rd as a turning point. Don't is a turning point. On that show, the promos were electric, advancing key stories like the surprise heel turn of Ric Flair to align with MJF. Even Wardlow cut the best promo of his career. Everything clicked and got fans more invested than ever before. In the years since, All Elite Wrestling has gone from strength to strength creatively. The roster is stacked with phenomenal talents bringing their A-game every night. Matches are innovative, hard-hitting, and fast-paced. Promos feel authentic and unscripted. Big-time free agent signings like Cum Punk, Brian Danielson, and Adam Cole have provided star power. Homegrown talents like MJF, Darby Allin, Jade Cargill, Adam Copeland, and Dr. Rick Baker carry themselves like megastars. Most importantly, there is a feeling that history is being made. All Elite Wrestling has sparked a renaissance in wrestling by proving the industry doesn't have to cater to casual fans or shareholders. The focus is on serving the hardcore fans first. By doing so, All Elite Wrestling has made professional wrestling cool again. We're currently living in a golden age with All Elite Wrestling leading the charge. Sold out, crowds are rabid every week. Hey, pro view buy rates are through the roof. The level of enthusiasm feels akin to the heights of the Monday Night Wars era. With All Elite Wrestling setting the standard creatively, the sky is the limit for the prosperity of the entire industry in this wrestling renaissance.